Okay. Uh, we come on to uh, a lovely part of the lunch, uh, which is the uh, Women of the Year Awards. It is, of course, the 50th anniversary year, as we've been hearing, and uh, celebrating women who are creating extraordinary impact on current world events, as uh, well as we're going to look back uh, to honour the astonishing women whose far-reaching uh, influence has no doubt raised the bar for women and shaped our world today. Uh, so we're going to begin with the Women of the Year Outstanding Achievement Award. This is sponsored by, I have to say, in my opinion, uh, the best magazine in the country, and that's not just because I write for them. Um, please welcome the editor of Good Housekeeping. It is Lindsay Nicholson. This award acknowledges and celebrates an outstanding achievement where courage and determination are often the only spurs to keep going. This year, the award goes to not one woman, but to six. On the 16th of November 2004, their world fell apart when their brother Robert was murdered. Their determination to bring to justice the people responsible for his death sparked international outrage. Six ordinary women from Belfast who'd never taken a public stand in their lives now took on the world. They appeared on public platforms, on television, and gave interviews to the world's press. They were support supported by politicians from the European Union to congressmen in Washington, D.C., and from President Bush. In spite of continuing threats, violence, and intimidation, they've refused to be silenced in their pursuit for truth, justice, and a peaceful community. So the winners of the Outstanding Achievement Award for Women of the Year, sponsored by Housekeeping, is uh, the McCartney Sisters. But uh, I have to tell you uh, that they are not here to accept the award. Uh, it was only this morning that they discovered that they would be sharing uh, the podium uh, with the former British Prime Minister, and they felt that they were unable to do so. Now, I think everybody knows that political passions run extremely deep uh, in Northern Ireland, um, and that is why they're not here. However, the Women of the Year uh, would like to reiterate that we are extremely proud to recognize their remarkable achievement and we wish them all our continued support, the McCartney sisters.